Welcome Librans. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back, you Librans. Ooh. Uh. So this is uh, um the second week. Whatever is transpiring. I'm seeing deceptiveness with the Queen of Wands, but I see um the overcoming of this deceptiveness. Okay. So I see a cancer and a cancer and an Aries Leo and Sagittarius tried to do some deceptiveness, but they got caught. Okay, so that's the message that is coming up for you, Librans. So let's go in the reading and see what is happening. I want to say this week is beginning from the 16th until the 22nd. From the uh, Monday to Saturday, it is the energy of fire. So yeah, you guys, fire and hair doesn't work. As we come to Sunday, I see this deceptive situation that is working, okay? So, alrighty, let's see what transpires. You came out successful because um, whatever that they have done, some of them have gotten caught. I see the truth comes out about an, an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libran. Okay, whoever this person is, because she's the center of the week. She has done some real deceptive things with a, a, the Queen of Cups. These two have done some real deceptive things with the Queen of Cups. So let's see, on Monday, there could be some worries for you, Libran. On Tuesday, you're going to find out what has transpired. On Wednesday, the Wheel of Fortune is coming in because the Wheel of Fortune... I've um, let you know of a deceptive situation. You could have been the one who works with a older. These two older women has done some deceptive things, but I see you celebrating overcoming this issue. Whatever the message is, the message is going to come letting you know about this Aries woman and the Pisces woman as, who has done some deceptiveness. So, where is sleepless night truth is coming out the worries and sleepless night the truth is coming out liberance so um there was some worries and sleepless nights and the truth is now going to be coming out and the truth is coming out about a taurus virgo or a capricorn woman okay um um and whoever because you are worried to, um, yeah, because you have gotten yourself caught up doing something against this woman. And some of you are worried to death because the truth is, is going to come out. So you need to find balance because whatever you have done to a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion woman, uh, it could be a mother. It could be a friend. It could be just some um, random person that you have done some deceptiveness to and the truth came out. Now I see you trying to find balance to deal with your partner because your partner is aware of what you have done. Um, your partner found out what it is you have done. And um, I see you're trying to um, reconnect with the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person, but this lady is like, Please keep away from me. I don't want to have anything to do with you. So um, it could be a mother figure that you have some done some injustice to. I see the transition is coming up. So there's a lot of major arcana that is coming out in this week, Librans. That means you have done some karmatic situation. And um, what is transpiring and happening is that I'm seeing that the wheel of fortune is coming in, but um, this is uh, bringing out the lies and deceptiveness uh, that you have done, okay? This woman is a Leo. Whoever this woman is, this is the center of the week over this Leo because people are finding out the truth and lies about this Leo. Um, they realize that this Leo, it could be your parents, it could be your mom, it could be your parents. They found out what she has done. And the deceptiveness is coming out and she's going to be caught or she already been caught. Okay. So yes, she has been caught 
um um it could be your mom it could be a family member it could be a sister whoever this person is is an older person she has been caught because she has stolen something and she has been caught now your worries is over um because it's as if they see the truth about what has transpired um and you're trying to get yourself some of you uh librans know exactly what you have done you're trying to get yourself out of this but you know exactly what you have done and you're kind of worried because another person has caught for your deed but um if you didn't ask this person um this person wouldn't be caught up in this situation okay it was a situation a very deceptive situation that has played and extremely deceptive i see conflicts is coming up with the queen of cups whoever this queen of cups is i see some conflicts um but um whatever is transpiring i see this queen of cups is having some conflicts with a pisces cancer a scorpion but i see you're going to be finding out the truth and combing through the truth of this situation i'm seeing a tower moment coming down a tower moment is definitely coming down on the queen of ones whoever the queen of ones is a tower moment is coming down on her and i see that she has to pay back a lot of money Whoever the queen of ones is has done some deceptive situation and the toe moment is coming down on her and she has to pay back a lot of money. Um, this woman either have to pay back a lot of money or all of her assets is going to go to that lady, the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn. You all have paid in a deceptive situation. Not all of you, just some of you you person you people know who you are especially the ones that is worried um and um the um a young taurus virgo or capricorn person is going to be getting out of the situation they're pulling out themselves and trying to find a healing to the situation okay so there was a lot of deceptiveness at play whatever that was happening and transpired there was absolutely a lot of deceptiveness at play but whatever the issue and the situation is, I see um, the truth is all going to be coming out. And some of you are very worried because the truth, you are, um, the truth came out and you're worried about the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn because she knows exactly what you did. If even you think that she does know, she knows. It could be your mom, it could be your sister, it could be your partner she knows i'm seeing her having conflicts with a pisces cancer or a scorpion and i see justice come down on this person i see you found out the truth what this person has done this is the queen um this is a pisces cancer or a scorpion i see the truth is coming out so whatever is happening these could have been people on the work floor for some of you these could have been family members but i'm seeing these people coming up as random but i see that some of you liberals have cut through the truth about this queen of swords what she have done okay so um some of you could find out that this queen of swords is family with this um uh, um Pisces, um, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. The Queen of Swords is family with this person, and they have done injustice to their own family. And you're cutting through, and you're finding out what they have done. Now, the energy of the magician is here, and the truth is going to come out about your partner, or about a family member, or someone that you're connected to. I see Elin is going to come true because you're going to be finding out the truth of what this person have done, and it's going to be very hard for you to forgive now this queen of wands could be a family member or someone who you have known okay this is a leo person and a very deceptive leo person but a tower came down on this person and you're going to be finding out the truth about this person the tower came down on this person and the lies and deception and your information and stealing from you this is an older woman a very deceptive woman this woman um plays in the metaphorical um world where she um use negative forces also but a world is coming down her world and you're going to be finding out about this because the truth came out and it's all about family money it's not her money and she wasn't supposed to have it it's all about family money okay it could be a mother figure but it's not coming up as a mother figure this person does come up as a real deceptive person it is a leo her world is really she has to they're going to be taking back every assets and give it to the the taurus virgo or capricorn person because she used her information to acquire what she has okay 
then we see transition the wheel of fortune is coming bring in transition i see some of you are trying to find strength to deal with this deceptive situation some of you could be have could have caught up in this situation but you find out exactly what has transpired the deceptive situation that happened with a gemini and a leo the truth is coming out okay so a deceptive situation that happened to a gemini and a leo the truth is coming out i'm seeing some of you dealing with an aquarius and you're going to be overcoming as issue with an Aquarius and a Gemini whoever these persons are you're definitely overcoming this situation some of you are dealing this person could come up as a son or daughter is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn this person whoever this person is it is basically um, someone that um, is going to they're going to be successful over you whoever and there is a, a, a cancer there is a cancer because I'm seeing whatever is transpiring with you, um, Librans. I see you up, uh, you're going to be successful over this night of Pentacles. This is a young man or a woman between the age of 18 and 45. Between the age of 18 and 45, and you're going to be successful over him. I see a healing is coming out for this issue and situation that has taken place. So the center for most of you is dealing with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius person. Whoever this person is, is really deceptive. However this person come out in your life, this person is really deceptive. And what I'm seeing there is that the energy of debt is here. And the the the, 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 the hardship you have been going through um, is going to come to an end. And the deceptiveness that some of you were dealing with is definitely going to be coming to an end. So this is really positive, positive alignment of energy. In your um, stability, um, you are dealing with the Queen of Cups. Whoever this Queen of Cups is, you're going to be cutting through and finding out the truth, what this person has done. And uh, what is transpiring here? I'm seeing the page of ones in reverse because news is going to be coming out about a deceptive person. This is an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Could be your mother for some of you. It could be a haunt. It could be a friend. Whoever and however this person is coming up, her information is about to come through, and you're about to find out what this person have done. Deceptiveness that um um a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn between the ages of eighteen and forty-five has brought. And you're going to be overcoming this deceptiveness okay so this is a positive energy after all that is happening in this week i see you're going to be successfully overcoming an issue um with this lady okay this lady so you are going to be working on duality it is the energy of the sun blossom is the energy of the sun i see an end coming to this lady and her deceptiveness and what she has done and transpired I see sadness of embrace is here for you, um, um, Librans. A sadness of embrace to find out what this lady has done. Okay, so a sadness of embrace, but it could be sadness and hurt um, to see what this lady has, has, has done. Okay, sadness and hurt um, to see what this lady has, 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 has done. Some of you is, is, is a family member. Some of you is someone who you have known. Some of you, this person is just a random person that has really deceived you and try to get you in some serious trouble. You could have asked this lady to do it. And this lady is uh, coming out. I see the energy of the clouds is coming up. So, um, whatever is transpiring with this Leo lady, I see it's dark for this Leo lady. Um, whatever she has done or transpired is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius because she has done some deceptive things. So what other message? The sun. Yes. Some of you, uh, I see you're going to give a Capricorn Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person luck because you want peace between you and this person. So you're going to speak the truth. You're going to speak the truth and help out a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person because you want peace within the situation because now you find out the deceptiveness that has played and why um, they had asked you to get involved with a situation. I see you want to reconnect with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person. This is a woman, forty-five years and older. I see um, you're going to be giving her luck because um, you realize the deceptiveness that played and that you were used in a situation, and you want peace between you and this lady. You're in a sad embrace because you found out uh, all the deceptiveness that has transpired, and you felt so bad 
you're in a sad place but you want healing to come in this healing is definitely going to be coming in okay so i'm leaving it there until next week please like and share um this please like and share and i want to say to each and every person you know be honest and uh, you know be careful what you do to other people because it will come back to you i love you guys have a wonderful holiday i speak to you next week